Hello everybody, this is the new project I'm working on with the golf cart right now. Um, as you can see I have the motor out of the golf cart. It's in pieces. You can see here, these are the two electrical contacts with the motor and these are the brushes which can slide in and out as you can see. Brushes are pretty much brand new. haven't been around that long and then there's these little springs which clip onto there get pulled back oh shit they clip on there they get pulled back and then they push the brushes in to feed them well I washed this out yesterday and I've been letting it dry long time well that's dirty I've been letting it dry and now we're getting ready to put it back together you see this the main motor piece freaking heavy as hell got this spinner on this plate which screws into those holes there with these little screws then this is the outer plate. Got the big metal coils. This thing weighs a ton too. And uh just about to put it all back together. Okay, here's where I'm at now. I just got the inner coil screwed on the bottom. It took me about forever. Damn plate didn't want to screw on. Now I'm gonna start putting the little springs on this and as you can see this spins real nice and free, no wobble in there. Just about to put the springs on the brushes, and then we'll go to put it back inside. Okay, well, I got two of these springs on. See our little spring down there that's pushing this in pretty hard. Keeps it pushed in, nice pressure. Well, I'm going to show you quickly my technique for putting them on in case you're fixing your motor and you're just having the hardest time with this. And it's pretty simple. Let me show you. Okay, well, take a needle nose, add the spring, what you want to do is, the spring goes on like this, right, so we're going to crimp this part in, like that, and take the screwdriver, put it right in there, what we're going to do is we're going to put it in there, first make sure your brush is pushed in. I'm going to take it and turn it. Oh shit. You can see even with the right technique it's a little bit hard. Probably make some kind of special fancy tool for this but I don't have that. I don't need it. Okay. Try her again. Sure that's on there good. Turn it over, put it on. Just like that. Now it's on. Simple as that. Now I'm going to do the other ones and then I'll... Okay, now we're going to put the cover piece on top. some water to tell you and there you go now the cover is back on 
When we look down here, you can see it's almost but not touching. Still spins nice. Now we're going to flip her over and just put the bolts on. Okay. Everything is back together in the motor. Everything is all bolted on nice. We'll get ready to put it back in after I check some other stuff. So stay tuned for the next video when we put it back in.